nigga, that's that shit I don't like. Nah. A snitch, nigga, that's that shit I don't like. Nah. A bitch, nigga, that's that shit I don't like. Nah. Sneak this up, that's that shit I don't like. Don't like. Good gangy, we back, we back. So hopefully this time I'm back for real because uh W schedule hasn't been the best. Anyways, in this video, I'll be reviewing the Sovio version 2 edit pack. So recently he came out with a new one and you know, we'll check it out, share what's inside and give my opinions at the end. Now the pack is for basically every software. I think it's for Premiere, After Effects, Vegas and for the three people that still use DaVinci, you also got that. What I do? What I and you can find the editing pack in the description below. It's a pay hip link. Anyways, let's get on with the review. Alright, so here we are in the Google Drive. And I don't want to bore you by showing you everything. I'm just going to show you what's the most important. So first of all, we have the plugins. You can get it over here on my server. Then we have practice clips. And we got some clips from Lasex, Juts, and one of his edits. Moving on, we have overlays. So there is a bunch of overlays. And all of these are glitch overlays. And in my opinion, they're really good. Of course, he didn't make them. But uh, yeah, they look cool. And then we have tutorials so i'm pretty sure this is the first time he makes proper tutorials and i don't know if i made him do it but i made a tweet once saying how people that make packs you know should make tutorials and there are some tutorials he actually made some so we have one on how to use project files uh, another one on how to make audio buildups which is good and finally how to make and use presets All right next up we have transitions so over here we only have premiere pro transitions i mean i would have expected you know all of the softwares but that's what he uses and it is what it is so then we have sound effects uh it is everything he uses so then we have his presets and it goes all the way back from 2021 and to now 2023 now i'm gonna show what they look like later in the video but as you can see new style presets they got presets for every single software. Then moving on, we have skin glows. Once again, from his old ones to his new ones. Now what you need to make sure is that they're all for After Effects. So, you know, don't confuse yourself. Don't think that it's going to be possible in Vegas. I mean, Vegas skin glows, I've done it before. They're just bad. But then we have project files and once again all of his project files most of them i guess and in the new style one i guess that's what you guys are most interested in this is all the project files and yeah a lot of new ones and then to finish off the pack we have cinematic text has four different styles of it and going into the new style you'll have the project file also on the side some fonts that he used on his cinematic text and that's it with the edit pack now i'm going to show you the new presets Right, and to top it all off, of course, gotta give my opinion and my score. So I give this pack a solid 8 out of 10. You know, it's not a perfect pack, but it does the job and it makes you edit like Sovio. Uh, the things I would like to see though, is maybe a project file with all files. So instead of me just opening the project file and seeing nothing, I would like to at least see what's happening and you know, have a better understanding. Also, maybe the sorting could have been better. The fonts could have been sorted better. The presets could have been put into one and uh, the transitions. I feel like transitions for only Premiere Pro is kind of annoying. You know, you should be able to have transitions for all softwares because maybe someone doesn't want to install Premiere. But that's the only negatives I have to say about the pack. Once again, if you want to buy it, it's linked in the description. And yeah, as always, this was Pixie. I'm out.